Mr. Vibes Live. Mr. Vibes Live. The radio play. Voice of Kamange 87.9. Welcome to some other episode of the Weekend Zone Show. My name is Mr. Vibes Live. We have uh, taken a visit to Kasese and uh, like we promised you last Saturday that uh, there was going to be uh, the Make Me Famous album listening party. It is where we visited and uh, we are giving you highlights about the Make Me Famous album, the musician owning the album, the musicians that feature on the album. We have a producer, we have songwriters. We'll be talking to them from now up to 2 p.m. in the afternoon to tell you what is happening, especially in the music industry, partly in Kasese and in Western Uganda. Make Me Famous album uh, is uh, some other album from uh, musician Haley Baby. And uh, it features 16 songs, it has uh, 11 producers, 6 songwriters and uh, 6 musicians that feature on the album. We'll be talking to one by one uh, of the people we have today. We are starting with the main musician, your names and uh, you know people should know about you because most of the people hear you on different songs, they don't know what is all about you. Mm. My name is Heli Baby, Mama La Mama, all from the Rainsories. Mm. I'm an artist. You've been hearing about Vibes has been playing my songs. 
is being supportive i released a new album it's called make me famous and this make me famous is is having a lot of musicians especially musicians from kasese both male and female okay. and it was featured with more producers producers from kasese producers from barara and producers from kampala so just know it's a very nice combination it has nice songs featured good songwriters just know it's wow the baby has never been a christian name what are your real names where in kasese do you come from Hey baby my name is lois agawa itungo i'm from Bwera. that is my home village where all my parents are alive mm. and i stay in kasese town most times and sometimes in kampala yeah okay people have heard you on different songs commando too much you have why and some other songs uh, how did your music journey begin and how far have you moved before we look at the album mm, i started officially in 2019 mm. with a collab with manseo one of our artists mm. around kasese it was called unyoke and i'll say it's still booming right now mm. it's a very nice song from that time i got i got the management that is counter music which i'm still with right now mm. and i'll say since then my journey has been not bad because they've been treating me well okay yeah let's look at make me famous album the first days of listening to that word make me famous we saw songs of why why something coming out uh what is all about the album Mm, the album make me famous it's not all about people think it's make hell famous mm. make me famous is not all about making me famous it's about making renzori music famous to the world okay. you know regardless of the language we speak we want people to know that we have music worth listening to mm. we have music that you can vibe to you can dance to like other music let's okay. say nigerian music we don't hear what they sing but we vibe on it so we just want to let people know that we also have a good talent we have something good okay mm. thank you very much voice of kamwenge reading amama runji is the weekend on show my name is mr vibes live we have uh, Hilly Baby and uh, we are specifically talking about the Make Me Famous album and uh, you know the album was released on Sunday uh, 23rd of October 2022. Let's look at the album first of all. We want to look at track number 16. You feature Kanyele on the song I'm Fine. Hello baby na Kanyere Trabia to casa o nós e tu caiu anga se me lobi de mamã Abafumbi bakalira itwa kwa buba itwa yo wanamu What is it all about? I'm fine. It's a song about the maret abafumbo. Mm. Those who are fine in their homes. We see these girls expressing how they feel when they are in their homes that they are fine in their homes they're being treated well mm. so it's all about love this album most songs are about love you know we need to spread love okay. everything is about love so it's a love song okay of all musicians you look at collaborating with Kanyele what is so special maybe about her Kanyele is a talented girl she's a talented lady yes I chose her cuz I saw we vibed together. Mm. She's a, it's a good combination. Okay. That's what I'll say. Most of the musicians for example on uh, the female side they be beefing each other. For example, you're from Kasese, Kanyele is also from Kasese and maybe you're all good musicians. One looks at the other as maybe the best and there is some beef. How is the relationship between you and Kanyere? Me and Kanyere are best friends. Mm. That's what I would say. Not only Kanyere but most most of the musicians here, we are best friends. Okay. Uh beefing, 
especially in this industry everyone has their talent even if i'm singing nicely there is a difference between you and me you sing well i sing well there's a different way you sing in there's a different way i'm singing in so there is no competition i'll say there can't be competition because everyone is special in their own way okay yeah track number 15 your ways Uh, I listened to that song and it has some Runyankole statements. Mm. Tell us about your ways. <laughs> your ways, it's also a love song. Mm. I'll say it was written by Kanyere. Okay. It was produced by Dofe and Alpha Music. It's a love song. You know, we need to mix these languages because okay. not everyone hears Lukonzo, but at least if you fix in some other language, someone will say, oh, it's about this, it's about love. Mm. You know, that's why we mix languages. Okay. Mm. Thank you very much. We have Dofe, we'll maybe share with him later. Uh, we can look at track number 14, Sona. Dofe on the bed. Sona means what? Sona, it's mend. Okay. Okutunga. Mm. Sona is also, mm, it's also a love song. Okay. Sona, like, omoti mawai, Sona. I'm giving you my heart, you should mend it. Okay. Evia, Evia, Lima, Balala, you should mend it. Mm. My money, you should mend it. It's all about love. Okay. Mm. It was written by who and produced by who? It was written by Tip Tony and it was produced by Dolphin. Okay. Thank you very much, Voice of Kamangi Reading Omarunji, being to be a baby. Queen Vita is uh, the artist that features on your album uh, from Bondibujo. Yeah. What does the song call for? Been to your baby. Mm. It's, it's also a <laughs> lot. <laughs> It's also a love song. Mm. This girl is from Bundibuja. So she's a talented girl. Mm. She's very talented. Okay. You know, I, I called I called upon those guys of Bundibuja to get me someone at least to make a collab with because we have no collab from Bundibuja. Mm. Uh, I think that's what I know from okay. Kasese. So I chose to future with someone from Bundibuja and we see how it goes. Okay. And it really went well. It's a very nice song. It's also a song of love. It was produced by Isra Mento and it was written by Queen Vita. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much, Voice of Kamwenge. It is the weekend's on show. We have Haley Baby. We are talking about Make Me Famous album. The album came out on Sunday of 23rd of October 2022. And, uh, you know, we are in Kasese, Vingolele. Ovinkore. Okay. When I look into your face, I feel like I want to fly. Pull a king and be your princess, cause you want another kind of sweet. So who wrote this? What is it all about? And who produced? Being called it has it's also a love song. Mm -hmm. It was written by Jason. And it was produced mm -hmm. by Isra Mento. It's a love song. You guys should get time and listen to this album. How comes love is dominating all your songs? Love. Mm -hmm. Everyone needs love. We're all here some, for the love. Some people have broken hearts. Do you have any song on your album for those people? <laughs> uh, huh, this time I didn't make a broken heart song for those who are broken. But I did it before. What was it? Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much, uh, Eche, featuring Paroma. Mama la mama. 
Uh -huh. What is it all about? It's also a love song. Mm. I it featured Paloma. Paloma is our new artist around the Rangeries. Mm. I'll say it was a kind of introducing her to the industry. Mm. She didn't sing much in the, in, in the song, but it was a kind of introduction, okay. introducing her to uh, to the industry. So it's also a love song. Okay. Mm. We have Paloma. Uh, we can maybe talk to her uh, to Gambiri how you know it means to her to feature on the Make Me Famous album. Uh, first, tell us your actual name. My actual name. My name is Musoki Sandra Vicky and I'm Konja by Shai. It's really a very sweet moment and the biggest opportunity to have this featuring with the most loved and known artist. So being an upcoming, it's really a pleasure and it's already a big opportunity to me to introduce me to music in that way. I see that there is a path that I've already got, that it is already dug and I have to surely fight for it. Okay. Yeah. You have featured on the album that has 16 songs. What does it mean to you, for example, as a young musician, as a starting musician? Yeah, like seriously, to be part of The Chosen, it's really something you have to even know about. Because maybe also God knew that really Paloma needs this opportunity and sent heavy. I was like, please help this lady and build up this. So it's really something that you can't even show its appreciation because it's really big. Okay. Yeah. You, apart from the song you featured on, how do you look at the rest of the 15 songs from uh, the album? It's really a playlist that you can play all day and you can't even get tired of. It's something that can make you feel the vibe. It can even inspire you in music, you never know. You may even feel like I should also begin singing. What does the song you feature don't mean, uh, especially when you translate it to real life? To real life, this is an interaction between two ladies whereby one is looking for his love. And seriously, yeah, love is for two people, but you find you can't really handle it. Still, other people have to come in. So you have to get help from for someone if you're really looking for your love. Is it based on a true story? Not kinda. <laughs> Okay, thank you very much, Voice of Kamwenge Reading Amomarunji. We're back to you. And we have uh, track number 10. It features B. Nelly. I don't know the style of this song, but um, is it a piano? I listened to it and I couldn't understand it. <laughs> the style of this song is rumba. It's called rumba. It's a Congolese style. Okay. Yeah. So where does Binelli come from? Binelli is one of our legendary artists around Kasese. Okay. Uh, we chose to feature at least one of the legendary artists. So we saw he fit in the style that we were looking for mm -hmm. and he really did it well. Okay. Yeah. So what is it all about? The title is uh, Nemwasa. Nemwasa is, is uh, a song of, let me say, giveaways introductions mm. like if your wife is introducing you to your parents that party to name was sir okay. yes you're coming from your home that interaction between the man and the lady mm. you're on the way coming and the lady saying please don't lie to me mm. we have prepared everything we are ready we are waiting for you that is the song thank you very much voice of kamwenge reading mama runji we have track number nine this one has been playing here for some quite good time something there is something about you that make me go crazy, crazy. something like that uh -huh. what is it all about and uh love love love, love. Mm -hmm. it's all about love the yeah. video of this song is already out mm -hmm. uh it has been in circulation working very well actually on youtube and some other streams mm -hmm. How far with uh, something, for example, right now? I'll say something is doing well because mm. it's it's in three weeks, two weeks right now, and we are around twenty three k on okay. YouTube. I'll say it's doing well. 
uh something was written by leaders and chip tony mm. it was produced by do face still okay. i said that 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 was a best combination it's a nice song okay track number eight don't mind this is a i'll say is it a jacking song mm. like guy doesn't care about the girl he finally comes back wanting to be with a girl and the girl says no i don't mind anymore because whatever you've been doing has not been favoring me so i don't mind okay. i don't mind anymore it's also a love song it was written by jason and produced by by instrumento i've not seen jason in love how comes he knows about you know love things hey, <laughs> you never know people don't always show these days don't show whether they're in love or they're not tip tony features on self-contained Kiki, Ellie, baby, oh. oh my baby baby First of all, about Tip Tony on self contained, why of all people Tip Tony? <laughs> Tip Tony is a very talented guy, mm. he's one of our best male artists in the Renzori. Mm. I'll say he's a talented guy, he's a writer, he's a singer, he's a performing artist. It was a good combination. Like, I can't take a year without making a collaboration with Tip Tony, mm. I don't think I can because. Every year I've been making a collaboration with him mm. and of course he had to feature on the album I couldn't leave him out okay. no nah. yeah let's hear from Tip Tony maybe he knows more about the song self contained means what first of all who is Tip Tony and uh, by original names yeah, I am Tip Tony I'm a performing artist my original names and Bambale Crispus. Bambale Crispus. Yes. Tip Tony, you've been in music. Uh, you featured Heli on some other songs, but let's specifically look at Self Contained. What is it all about? It's just love. Kuwana Munno. That's what it means. Okay. Mm. So, what does it mean to you featuring on the Make Me Famous album? I cannot tell, I can't explain. Mm. Yeah. And <laughs> and can't explain. Like, mm. Yeah. Okay, uh, you're part of the album. Mm. What do you expect, for example, especially on the song that you're featuring on? I expect only good things. I know to work. Mm. Yeah. How do you look at the album, for example, uh, the whole album, including your song? It's just sweet mm. okay. and blessed. Okay, thank you very much. His name is Tip Tony. We didn't get who produced the song and uh, who wrote. We wrote it, I and La Mama, okay. and then the producer is Dove. Okay. Thank you very much. We should talk to the producer first of all. You have been part of most of the songs on the album. Uh, being a home producer, tell us about you know your names and uh, your studio. Yeah, my name is Producer Dove. Original name, um, yes, Alan Mumberi. Okay. <laughs> yes. So, uh, yeah. the studio? The studio is BK Records. BK Records. Yeah. Uh, you have been releasing music. Mm. Uh, but specifically, let's look at Make Me Famous album. Uh, which songs did you feature on as a producer on the album? Kuna nyimbo nyingi zenye wali, zenye walifanya, zenye tulifanya featuring na our producers. Like uh, Self Contained, Mathematical, yeah. mm, something, uh, ni nyimbo nyingi. Okay. Ila mimi na charibu just to make a beat. Mm. Uh, mastering is likuwa za watu wengine. Mm. Yeah. First of all, uh, what does it mean to you to feature on this album of 16 songs from an artist, for example, from Kasese? Because we have seen artists do single songs, but this is an album. I think I'm going to make a beat and a full beat, because I'm going to make a beat and 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 a sharing tufanye tupime kama hata wengine wa produce tuone kama tunaweza fanya kitu kizuri okay yeah thank you very much voice of kamwenge reading a mama ronji track number 6 es sony panda 
What does it mean? This is Sony is Asian being shy. Okay, so who produced and uh, who wrote? It was produced by his, by, by Rico Pro and it was written by Jason. Okay, thank you very much. We have uh, track number five. Which style is YUY? YUY. Hmm. It's is a full beat. It's okay. a full beat. Mm. YUY means mine. Eh? Mine, mine. So, yeah. what is it all about? Love. Mm. Love, love. Okay. Mm. Who wrote and who produced? YUY was written by Tip Tony. Mm. Mm. It was produced by Dofe. Written by Tip Tony, produced by Dofe. How is it performing? Uh, it was, I think, the first song on the album to be released. Yeah. So how is it performing? It's doing well. Mm. It's also doing well. Okay. Mm. Thank you very much. Uh, we have track number four. I think I love the title of the song even before it was out. Yeah. <laughs> This song is also a nice song. Mm. It was it was it was produced by Instrumental okay. and written by Jason. It's also a love song. Okay. Mm. Thank you, uh, Mathematical. Uh, it is uh, featuring Bida Sis. Canta music. Size mukene. Mama la mama. Oh, what is it all about? Mathematical. It's also a love song. Okay. Of all, uh, <laughs> maybe the artists, leaders, uh, why leaders? Sis is 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 also a great talented guy. Mm. He's a writer. He's a singer. He's very good. Okay. I'll say he's good. Of course, I have to do with him. I can't do without doing with him. It's like Tip Tony. Mm. I can't take a year without doing with him. He's 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 my fellow artist in management in counter music management. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Mathematical is also a love song. Yeah. You people with love. What's up? <laughs> okay. Let's talk to Lida C's Saizi Mokene. First of all, uh, the title of the song. How much did you score in, in mathematics? <laughs> Now, when we come to mathematics, mm. I think I wasn't that good. Actually, I was I was over average. But then sometimes there are sometimes we we get and then use in songs like mathematical. Someone can understand it. Mathematical means adding minus, okay. uh, dividing, and other things. So mathematical in the song means uh, everything that we do is on plan. Okay. Mm, if I'm to give high gift. It is also planned where and when I'm supposed to give her that gift. So that is all about the song mathematical. Okay. Mm. First, tell us about leadership because, uh, much as we are talking to you, most of the people may, may be hearing about you, but they don't know where you even come from. Tell us about yourself. Okay, leadership is an artist performing recording uh, from Kasese, and originally I'm called Imombere Salvin. Yeah, and I've been in in the industry since 2019 up to now. Things have been so well. Okay. Mm. So, Mathematical was written by who and uh, produced by who? Yeah, I wrote it with Heli. Mm. Then Dofe produced it. Okay. Then uh, Herbert Skills had to master okay. the song. What is your opinion uh, about the whole album? The 16 songs? Okay, the album is so so good. Mm. All the songs are nice. Okay. Actually, I enjoy listening to it. I've been listening to it, and even before when it was still on the website of Canto Music, also, I was listening to some of the songs. Okay. It is so fantastic. We had to put in a lot of ideas, a lot of people, producers, mm. and then we had to bring all the minds together so that we can produce something which is so fantastic. Okay. And I think the people are really appreciating the efforts we had to put in, in the album. It is so nice. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, about leaders, information has it that you have plans of releasing a song with uh, Barara's Truth 256. Mm -hmm. How is it all about? Okay, uh, the song, I wouldn't want to, 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 to say 
too much about it mm. but it's true we have a collaboration with truth 256 of mbarara it is coming in i think by next month we, we will have sorted everything mm. so the song is going to get out and it's so 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 good it is massive i know the western uganda is going to dust on it and even okay. uganda at all okay mm. thank you very much voice of kamwenge ready young Bama uh finally on uh the album there is a gospel song amen i also listen to it and uh, some good gospel music what is it all about Amen. It's all about thanking God mm. for everything He has done. He has been there for us from the start, from the beginning. We started this till now. He's still leading us. It's been God. Okay. So we have something to thank God for. It's okay. really something to thank God for. Who wrote the song and uh, who produced? Mm, it was written by Jason Steele mm. and it was produced by Alpha Music. Okay. Uh, Thank you very much. Finally, make me famous. Uh, the name of the album. Actually, it's an introduction mm. of the album. Mm. It talks about the album, what the album is all about, why I did the album. Mm. That's what it is all about. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Uh, how have you experienced the recording of the song, you know, the collaboration? and you know the planning of this album uh, i'll say this album has great great efforts we had to come together to come up with this and i'll say it was a great job especially from my management mm. those who helped oh. us write the producers everyone i'll say everyone did their best okay everyone did their best those who produced those who wrote everyone did their best to contribute to this album what is your opinion on the album? The 15 songs that you've released and those people you featured on your album, what is your personal opinion about those songs? Mm, uh, me personally, I enjoyed my album. I say I outdid myself. I've never done something like this before. It's a nice album to listen to. There is no bad song. That's what I know as for me. There is no bad song. Okay. And i'll say so far it's doing well it's doing so well okay. people are buying it which we didn't even expect people are buying it like seriously mm. even if it's out for free but people are purchasing it from our website okay so i'll say it's doing well already and i believe it will do well still the album mainly focuses on renzori region uh, musicians from renzori region uh, maybe some of the producers are not from the region, but for the writers, they are all from Renzori region. Why are we not looking at maybe the rest of the western part and possibly central region? As I said, Make Me Famous is all, is all about making Renzori famous. It's all about our Renzori music industry mm. to be known to the world. Okay. That's why we chose to do the collaborations. Everyone was from here. The writers were from here, apart from some producers, because we really needed them to okay. bring this out. Okay. So it's all about Renzori, bringing Renzori talent out to the world. Okay. Those who didn't know we have good writers, those who didn't know we have good producers, that's what it is all about. Okay. Mm. Thank you very much. Let's first talk to the manager. We get back to you, your names, and uh, what you do under counter music. We were our riches were voice of Kamwenje, Amazina, Banyetam Hindo Ibrahim, well known as manager Ibzo. Mm -hmm. So Nikolanka Fed manager and a personal manager for brand leaders. Okay. Share with us the process of uh, you know moving from here, you know, to Mbarala to record, to you know, receive this other musician from Bondebujo to do what? How was the process in the making of this Make Me Famous album? Oktuari Zahamwe, Kaguru Mumuinji. Kuzo connecting an hour, Vasigazi, Abambara, Kafnayo, Mnyani Wito, Omeva Kweta Kacheche, Babena Chirak Stamps, Amnonga. Atronera Korabos, Sinkia Tipo, Commando Mukura, Nev Gamnongo, Kumbiaro, Pautiant Kora, Air Truth to Five Six, It's Takarequire, 
ikindi cyakabiri ati sabinyine ni bampa manyi mwana yakwa kwiza yine kakantuke yakahandi kereka rungi ni wakareba mu horangwe akatika kisemerire kasese ngwe kanka toare abat skills kampala what is your opinion about the album uh, album ya make me famous iwo kuri kugireba nebyo chongoro byo nebiroho ukaji gambire hoje mwenye otinyine bgambo binji kiyaho ni sima bana banje byeso ingoro byona we nire ogamba mazima omba chabin kugena ni mpolikiriza na media uko kurebesa ijo ku performinga bye shongoro bonira bo kuba wasanga ibari zo barumwe riyo ndiye rukumo um viewers rukumi ikintu cyangwa umunonga thank you very much voice of kamwenga reading the mama runchi we have uh, the kanta group ceo share with us your name uh, my name is uh, melody wambale okay uh, so how is it moving at kanta music Mm, all I can say we're moving well at least day after day. The next day is always better than the previous day. At least tomorrow I'm very sure will be better than today. So what I can say is we are moving so. Let's specifically talk about the album. How did it begin at Kanta Music uh, to record a 15 track album for musician Heli Baby? Uh, you know at Kanta every year we have a roadmap we follow. We know what we're going to do tomorrow, we know what you're going to do next week and we know what you're going to do next year. So uh, since 2020 we had the plan of the album and we started preparing for it. Actually one of the projects on the album it was recorded in 2020 so we started working on the album in 2020 we had up to 30 songs made and we had to filter out the best 15 it wasn't an easy journey but we made sure that at least we deliver what we can most of uh, the musicians and people investing in music in western uganda have fear that albums may not work specifically looking at releasing many songs at a go What and where did you get the confidence to release 15 songs at a go and uh, what do you expect from them Actually it is just a mindset it is a mindset that uh, an album cannot work the audience is ready to consume what we give them it is us the musicians it is us the artists the managements who are supposed to set the trend so when we set a trend that we can release albums if we show them that we are capable of releasing a full album okay. they will prove to us that they are capable of releasing a full album Okay. So it's all about us starting something and when we start something the fans are going to move on. Thank you very much. On Tuesday uh, we had uh, a video of uh, Kanyele and Heli that is part of the album. So far we have three videos from the album. When should we expect the rest of the videos uh, for the songs? Mm, actually we want to we want to be releasing a video every month for the next 13 months. That is the plan we are having. So we want to work on a roadmap of having a video every month. That is for the next 13 months. That is from today to December 2023. Okay. Yeah. What are challenges you faced at Kanta while working on this album? Yeah, actually we are working on a budget, a very big budget. We are working on a budget of 100 million. That's what we expect to spend uh, at the end of uh, the release of this album. But as you know, this is a business. Yet Riyako it's what all these artists you're seeing this is where they work mm -hmm. so uh, in any kind of business you get in prop in proportion to what you invest in so we expect with the investments made and uh, with the right investments made it's going to pay out well okay. uh, it might not pay out well today it might not pay out well tomorrow but the future is going to be better your message to the people uh, that love this music that love heli music and uh, you know some other music from kasese uh, my message is you people you should keep supporting the music keep streaming and actually one thing i want to request from the people supporting uh, western uganda music let's start streaming this music let's start buying this music online thank you very much voice of kamwenga radio nga mama ronji we have uh, you know the crew that is part of the make me famous album we are finalizing uh, as an artist maybe we heard from the management as an artist Two challenges did you face while recording this album and maybe dealing with uh, these other musicians and producers? There was uh, no big challenges. Mm. Everything okay. was good. What would be your message to the people that love your music, the people that support uh, music from Western Uganda as we finalize? My message to them is is appreciation just mm. I appreciate their support like this support makes us move forward it's okay. the support that gives us the energy to keep moving I'll say they should continue with their support 
I promise to give them the best, the very best. Thank you very much. Uh, I want us to hear some capella from these musicians on the songs they feature. We are starting with you. You can sing for us. Sure. My baby is self-contained. She's self-contained. I'm also reserved. Hey, hey. Thank you very much. His name is Tip Tony. Uh, he featured on the song Self-Contained on the album of Make Me Famous. We have you. Ah, it's Paloma. Paloma, you can The track is number 11. Uh, on the album, uh, her name is Paloma. From Cassese as well, we have uh, Saizi Mukene. Mathematical. It is track number 3 on the album. Mm. Uh, sing for us. Wama endi sutamba kajambo, oya kabi ni musango, toma sivisi tutaka nyae, ololu kabi alubansa ee. Mathematiko, olanzule tulubadire, teknologiko, olanzungu tralupanka. Mathematiko, olanzule tulubadire, teknologiko, olanzungu tralupanka. Thank you. Thank you very much. Leaders features on Mathematical on uh, Make Me Famous album. I want you to sing uh, Sing For Me. Track number four on the album as we finalize. Sing for me, you love sing for me. Boy, allow me to sing for you. Mm, let me sing for you. Internationally, locally, let me sing for you. Boy, your love is enough for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you very much. Uh, give a message to fellow musicians who feel maybe recording an album is impossible in the region. I'll not say it's easy, mm -hmm. but it, it depends on what you want. Okay. You can make it if, if you have the plan to. Thank you very much. This is Voice of Kamwenge, and uh, you're listening to The Weekend Zone Show. My name is Mr. Vibes Live. We had uh, a cross section of uh, musicians, producers, and songwriters from Kasese. And specifically, we wanted to talk about Make Me Famous album. The album has uh, 15 songs and, uh, you know, they feature six musicians, they feature six songwriters and 11 producers from Kasese, Western Uganda and Kampala. The album is already on YouTube and uh, some other streaming platforms. You can go there and have yourself one of the best songs or the whole album. Listen to some good music. We are getting to a break. When we return, we'll have more for you. I uh, will be coming with social media trends at 2 p.m. Otakarga Voice of Kamwenge.